And when we when do we want to do it? Now. Save Epcot. An El Cajon Citizens Group got its wish Tuesday afternoon when the El Cajon City Council reversed a late March. 4-0 to zero decision to support a developer's plan to demolish the East County Performing Arts Center and build a hotel in its place. Located in the heart of downtown El Cajon, the theater was built in 1977 by the Grossmont Cuyamaca College District and was deeded to the city of El Cajon some 20 years later. The 1,142-seat theater has had its successes, but has also had more than a share of financial losses and management failures. Despite community protests, the city closed the theater in 2009. The concept of guaranteeing the hotel, uh, you know, spending $2 million to demo the building, getting, putting, basically getting in the hotel business is what they're being asked to do. Local developer Neil Arthur proposed to the city council in late March to raise the theater and build in its place his vision for a 107-room four-star hotel with a 500-seat multi-purpose theater. But after intensive questioning, the council unanimously reversed itself and invited a local citizens group to submit a business plan to reopen the theater. Neil Arthur was invited to resurrect an earlier plan for a hotel on Ray Street, which would include the existing Performing Arts Center. Moving sites back to the original site would not be that difficult for me. I do not feel as though we've been frustrated. I do not feel as though we've wasted time. Now, I, I do not want to lose momentum because I think that the downtown for El Cajon does need an anchor like a hotel. There's a lot of uh, warm feelings for the Pack Center. And there's a lot of discomfort with the, the concept of tearing down a perfectly good theater and building another one when we have something that's, that's already working. You know, so, so I think it's just a matter of being creative and trying to find a better solution. It has been said that the opera isn't over until the fat lady sings. Right now, the way it's looking between the East County Performing Arts Center and the group which would like to run it and the El Cajon City Council, that the fat lady may be having an engagement here on stage very soon. In downtown El Cajon, I'm Paul Cruz, East County Magazine.